Greetings fellow soul travelers, I'm Esther and today's Wednesday Wisdom is Love is a Verb. I love you is a statement that is thrown around so easily these days that it has just about lost any meaning. Today I want to share with you that love is a verb. Now if you don't know the meaning of a verb, here's Webster's definition. A word such as jump, think, happen, or exist. That is usually one of the main parts of a sentence and that expresses now this is important, an action, an occurrence, or a state of being. Love is action, an occurrence, or a state of being, not just something to be said. And we see it all the time. In closing, people will say, I love you, or love you, as they blow air kisses, but do they really mean it? Can you go back to that person in a time of need and receive help? The people that say they live their lives by love don't always show it. Sometimes the people most in need of love will go to the churches looking for help, understanding, and love, but will only find ridicule and scorn from the congregation. Or it could be a parent, partner, sibling, or a child that is speaking these words, I love you. But when it comes time to show it or take action, they just can't produce. Love is a verb. Now I've had an experience just so, I've had just such an experience. I was in a situation where I was about to be homeless. I went to my spiritual community to let them know about my situation. After all, these are the people that said they loved me. But before I could even ask for help, I was hit with a wall of indifference. I was totally shocked and hurt at the response that I got from my then spiritual community. First I was told that I should pray. Next, I was told, I should talk to my spiritual group leader who also told me to pray. But the final blow that what it was the best. It came from the top, that spirit of the of the spiritual community. It was that I should take what I had learned and manifest what I needed immediately. Needless to say, I didn't feel any love coming from my spiritual community. They didn't even offer any physical help or words of encouragement either. It was as if they were angry with me for being in need. But what I needed was the verb love. I needed someone to take action immediately, to help me with housing or a couch. But that didn't happen. This was the spiritual community that was supposed to love me. But I was fortunate to have some true friends that understood that love is a verb. And they stood in the gap for me. They supported me with not only the state of being loved, but with the material things like food, shelter, and clothing, until I could help myself again. Their love lifted me to a place where I could see again. I could use what I knew to move forward. Now, you may have experienced a situation where someone told you that they loved you, and when the time came to show it, or you needed them, they couldn't step up. People can say the words, but do they really know what it means? Do they know that love is a verb? How about that? Now, if you've enjoyed this video, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Leave a comment below and share it with your friends and family. Love and light.